Man, I I love reading comments, bro. This that's like the best part of being a content creator is reading the comments, getting to see what people have to say, and then you can see the other side. Kind of, you you kind of get a get a notion of what they're thinking. And when they type this stuff, sometimes people can't fucking type, and it's all right. It's all right. It's fine. Everybody can't be the best at you know <laughs> conveying shit, shit and writing. But this came up, this came up real well, and I just wanted to share it because uh, Alan Richardson, thank you for commenting, bro. Thank you. Even though half of this shit don't apply to nobody, like he commented on the on the Halo video, and uh, he start off like every other fanboy start off as a X, as a Series X as well as PlayStation Five on it. First of all, we don't fucking care if you spent a thousand dollars on two consoles, bro. Like, uh, I'm more responsible <laughs> than to buy two consoles. <laughs> Why would I need two anyway? I'm one person. I can't play two consoles at one time. I mean, my setup's pretty nice. I got a gaming PC, you know. I got a I got an Xbox Series X right here, and that that's all I need. Like, if you if you prefer one over the other, get get the one you gonna use, bro. There's no point of buying an Xbox Series X just to say you have one and not play it. Like, <laughs> would you gonna buy two subscriptions to play online? You're gonna be... Uh, that just sound like a bad money move, bro. I'm just saying, like, it doesn't sound like you're responsible with money, but we're gonna keep going. <laughs> and I have to say, Halo Infinite is on the box of the Series X. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. The, the Series X box is over there. You can't see the Halo on it because it's on the back. So, Halo is on it. It's on the, it's on the back of the box, though. So... You, you don't really see it. You see the Series X on the front. You see Halo on the back because it was flagship. Yeah, he's right. It was it's on the box. Yeah. And it came out in November 2020. Yes, it did. Yes, it did. It came out in November 2020. It's August. Yes, it's August. We know. <laughs> so either way, if it released unfinished or gets delayed, it's unacceptable after all this time. We know that. But but when is it gonna be unfinished? All right, hold on, hold on. We gotta keep going. <laughs> Especially since, so, of course, you know, as a fanboy, when they have to do this, because if they were just gonna talk about Halo, they could have. But no, they have, they have fanboys have to put this in. Especially since Sony is in the same pandemic. Like, of course, like what? There's two pandemics. Did I for, did I miss something? Did Sony get a different pandemic from Xbox? No, nigga, we know, we know. <laughs> And has released more first party games since November 2020. See, but the but the difference between what Sony did and what Xbox did. Xbox released their games like normal. On Xbox One and then ported them to the Series X later. Sony purposely held games from the PlayStation 4 to put on the PlayStation 5 first. So yeah, Sony released more first-party games on PlayStation 5 since November because they held them from the PlayStation 4 where they belonged. <laughs> they belonged on PlayStation 4. Why do you think Godfall is on PlayStation 4? Why do you think Miles Morales is on PlayStation 4? You think Returnal couldn't run on PlayStation 4? Come on now, bro. Come on now, bro. D come on. Come on. No. No, <laughs> don't come in with that bullshit, bro. Yes, they they released more games on PlayStation 5 because they held them bitches from PlayStation 4. Those games should have been on PlayStation 4. And Godfall is on PlayStation 4. Miles Morales is on PlayStation 4 because that's where they fucking belonged. What PlayStation 5 game have y'all got? Because Returnal definitely could have been on PlayStation 4. You know Ratchet can be on PlayStation 4, but you know they hype up the SSD and all that. But that shit can run on the PC with a hard drive. So, <laughs> I mean, <laughs> I mean, to each his own with that. <laughs> and then he was like, they can forget game of the year or even being in a conversation <laughs> releasing and have game. Why do, why do you care so much about game of the year? Like game of the year is something that publishers and developers care about what the fuck the consumer got to do with game of the year ain't like you get the fucking vote yeah you get to pray that your favorite game wins game of the year but that has nothing to do with you bro 
when the Last of Us 2 won game of the year, everybody wanted Ghost of Tsushima to win. Last of Us 2 still won that bitch, though. Like, <laughs> like, what are you talking about? We don't care about fucking game of the year. Like, if 343 and Halo won game of the year, yeah. Good job, 343. You made a good game to the critics. But to the fans, if they hate the game, they hate the fucking game. It has nothing to do with us, bro. <laughs> but let's get to the other half of the comment, bro. So much for the nerve of that all... You you had to put all in all caps. All Xbox gamer call out Microsoft for their BS. What what BS are you talking about? Like I need more, bro. I need like what BS are you talking about? Cause we're on that. we're talking about Halo, and that's not a Microsoft problem. That's a three four three problem. If three four three can't make a good game, Microsoft just pays them to make a game. If three four three fails to make a game, they lose their job. That's a 343 problem, not a Microsoft problem. <laughs> I mean, co-op, which was promised by the devs to be available at release. When the fuck did they do? When did they specifically come out on stage? 343 was like, we're going to give you co-op single player <laughs> campaign <laughs> to play with your friend. No, they didn't fucking say that. It's just, it's always been in Halo. And this time it's not going to be there. And people are upset. It's not something that, oh, no. Oh, this has to be in Halo every fucking time. It doesn't have to be. Is, is it a luxury to have it? Yeah, if you want to play with your friends, if you playing on fucking Legendary and you getting your shit smacked up and you want your friend to come suffer with you, that's cool. If you want to throw some skulls up and try to do some challenges while you're playing the campaign with your friends, that's cool. But it's not a fucking requirement. It's just people treat it like it. And you know this man probably haven't played Halo since Halo 2. And it, he haven't played a Halo game with a person. <laughs> Since since 2007, bro. So I don't know what the hell is he talking about. And then, uh, hold on, where was I at? And the Forge mode <laughs> will also be missing. Like, do you even know what the Forge mode is? I don't know. The way he's talking, he's, he's talking like he know what that is. Like, <laughs> but I don't think he do. As well, shake my head <laughs> and half of that many of Xbox gamers are calling out Xbox out on it. Shake my head. You hypocrites know who you are <laughs> and y'all need to learn to keep that same energy. About fucking what? What are you going on about? Is this about Halo or is this about PlayStation? <laughs> we, I don't understand what he's on about. Like, I, as, I read, as I read this to myself, I'm like, so what the, what the fuck is he raving about? Because this was a video talking about how those two features right there are insignificant as hell. And a lot of people agree. And he's talking about since you can't play with your friend in single player campaign, the game is half finished. Damn, I didn't know you can play with your friend in, in The Last of Us 2 single player campaign. I heard they're supposed to have multiplayer, but I don't think that shit came out yet. Damn, are you keeping that same energy with them? They they don't count? Oh, I thought so. I thought so. Neither no wonder PlayStation 5 is selling is outselling Xbox Series X and S by doubling console units, so <laughs> you know they had to come straight back to fanboyism, bro. Who the fuck cares about console sales? Do you work for Sony or Microsoft? Probably fucking not, Richard. You wouldn't be commenting on my on my fucking video. <laughs> that means you're just a gamer just like we are. Why the fuck do you care about console sales? You bought each one. So why the fuck do you care? You, you got one of each. You shouldn't be worried. There's people out there that can't get one of one. Like, come on now, bro. <laughs> childish. These, like, these comments right here be so childish. And they be trying to sound like they're so... Uh, what do you call it? Unbiased. <laughs> but then their bias just show through the writing, bro. Are PlayStation 5 also in the Xbox is 2 to 1? I mean, it could be true. There's 100 million PlayStation 4s out there, and there's only like 55 million Xbox Ones out there. So, 2 to 1 is, two to one is right. They they have the, they have the they have, they got the bigger fan base, so they should be selling more consoles. And PlayStation start manufacturing first, so they definitely should have more consoles to sell. So... He's probably right about that. Two to one? I can give Sony that two to one. That's fine. What does that have to do with Halo? 
He said, no matter what good things Xbox does, reasons like this cast a shadow over them. Oh, so since we get games day one and game pass that PlayStation have to buy, since we get free upgrades to all our shit, we not buying director's cuts, since we get in upgrades to old backwards compatible games to run at 60 frames and HDR support, all those good things are happening. Oh, Halo not having co-op or Forge mode destroys all of that. Damn, that's some real shit right there. <laughs> I didn't know the whole console goes down because Halo doesn't have co-op in, <laughs> in Forge mode. Damn, okay, well, let me just throw my Series X away because all, all the Game Pass games like Psychonauts 2 is coming out tomorrow. And oh, I'm just about to throw my fucking Series X away and go buy a PlayStation 5 and buy it on there and I can just get it fucking free. Come on now, bro. I don't know what this comment was supposed to be doing. <laughs> but all this screams is PlayStation fanboy to be, bro. And like, hey, you can add me on Discord. We could talk about this, bro. We could, we can, we can legit talk about this. Explain yourself to me, because this don't make no fucking sense. <laughs> and I'm gonna leave it at that. So thank you all for watching. Like, subscribe if you're new. Hopefully, Alan see this. If if y'all know who he is, make sure y'all tag him. And uh, I'll see y'all in the next video.